Can you hear that? It's a sound of disappointment. <laughs> Philip is disappointed that we still could not beat him. And I cannot blame him for that. Hello everyone, it's Katrina here and I welcome you to this new episode of Library of Ruina. Last time we failed twice against Philip. And this time we'll try to succeed. First off, I should probably read that. Oh yeah, I I was thinking about using that in the last episode, okay. Uh so three of you guys have uh left the have left comments. Tenma NMC and gold. Yes, I was looking that up right now. And you guys have been saying that actually Philip is not that easy, and everyone else I talked to was like, yeah, Philip is probably the hardest fight of a, of, of a ten. And now I feel like a bit reassured, but I am not indeed just way too bad to play this game. Uh, one thing that I should probably run is Ginny. But at the same time, while it rolls incredibly high, it's also 4 cost. And I don't want to run two four costs, really, if I can avoid it. Or I drop one flow of a sword for it. Actually, I might just do that. So we can try that instead of what we had before. Now this is way too high a curve. We have to drop a motion of turbulence for another frontal, I think. That looks mildly better. We have a lot of we have a bit of a draw problem, but yeah. So Tema has told me that I should probably run Jinny against the uh, ranged pages he has in the final phase, and yeah, that makes a lot of sense because uh, melee pages get recycled. So one Jinny can block all the melee uh, all the ranged pages and then still hit with massive damage. We can have a draw pages, we could just brace up. We could indeed use brace up. Uh, it's not easy to decide here. Uh, whatever. So the reason why Charlotte was uh, apparently targeted all the time was because she has the lowest health. And Philip is a um, coward at heart. I had tried to somehow get the lowest health to be uh, at least like shared between two people. But then it dawned on me that I can't. <laughs> because, well, as it seems, we lack the uh, battle symbols. Also, Dennis's page has an 89 hour, but the next lowest, I think, was Hana Fixer of 97. Oh no, it's it's low of 95. So that's also out of a picture. So we have to deal with Dennis being attacked all the time. We just have to uh, rearrange it. Now, I was thinking about using some HANA pages, but they don't burn. So ideally, I would like to replace non-burn pages with non-burn pages, if that makes sense. And honestly, we don't necessarily need Frontal Assault here. We could use Forward March, but that wouldn't make so much of a difference. Mainly, the, the main difference would be that we do not get a Confirmed Emotion coin. So I'm, I was actually trying to think of better ways to play it, but it's really not all that easy. It really is not. So what, I'll go, what I'm going to do is I take the Ginny, I take whatever this is. Maybe we change a two cost here. Maybe we do change a two cost here. Uh, let me take two. From Inner Ardor to something that's actually Decent-ish. I mean, Fiery Dragon Slash isn't bad. Shao 2 is not bad. Bishi is... Bishi is actually really good. Bishi is actually good enough for me to consider it... To use it on this. Possibly turning this into a singleton and uh, roll with the singleton draws. Or like do uh, this, 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 or where's Bishi going? Or Bishi, Multislash, which is 
the one cost. And in that case, we could actually use uh, Forward March. Or even Brace Up, because we have Light. Do we? No, we only have... Mm, let's go for Light over that. So we have a somewhat weird page here, but maybe it works better than before. And we're too strong if it hits, for sh uh, which is, of course, might be a problem, but if it hits, we have a good chance. Uh, looking at this. It's really hard to make a choice here. Well, this doesn't do anything anyway, so we don't need this. Uh, we don't need Mirrors as passive because it doesn't deal, the burn doesn't deal any damage to him. Only helps against the small ones. Uh... Oh no, we don't have any of these guys left. Gloria's attributed, he is attributed, so we cannot put locked potential on her. That was an idea I had. But at that in that case. Hmm. Well, in case she is the last person that's alive. Like, she'll be the last person who gets massively attacked by Philip, I believe. So a Lone Fixer could maybe save us at the very end. If we if we do it smart. Since Mirrors doesn't really do anything, that can that could be the best choice we have here. Uh do you have Mirrors as passive? You don't. You have Mir you are Mirrors, so you do have Mirrors as passive. And you also have mirrors as passive, so I might change this to something else as well. To fervor. That was easy. Alright. And after this preparation, which you had to been a part of, let's try again. To begin this the reception of a floor of history. No need to talk to Philip. God, I love this battle theme. Okay, he's gonna attack Dennis four times. That's normal. That's how he's programmed. And now that I know it, it doesn't bother me so much. Uh, inflicting one burn twice means that this has a maximum burn up, but of, I think, five? No. To four, that means six plus the uh, flowing brand. That's like eight to ten. It could technically burn for ten, which is incredible. We do it here. So my plan is to put everything, uh, like to launch everything of this elsewhere, except for things that we know that Dennis can technically block. Like this doesn't matter to me. It is just one hit onto Shao. But I know that this can beat out this, so we take this here, and this can just go here. It ha he has counter dice, a lot of them, but we should be able to deal with that. That's a very bad start on Miris. That's an okay start on her, so she can go ahead and draw some cards and use unlock one because that means that we can get bad going faster. Mm, we don't draw the sword for light here. But you only have two. Oh yeah, I ended up not changing your deck. That was a massive mistake. Actually, you can re redirect this. Okay, you are the one with the worst start here. So you're just gonna... Frontal Assault twice, which means... You'll get a lot of uh, emotion coins, hopefully. 
Let's go. Nice. This is about what I expected. Seventeen burn is not quite enough. Uh, I think I'm gonna start with nostalgic days mainly because we don't know if we have a dragon fist in hand. And we didn't. Good thing we did. And we put that on Shao. Ah, we are just short of getting him to do that. Okay, that's fine. We still don't have an hand. Uh, you clash here. It's the best choice you have. You have Ginny and Air. That's perfect. We keep that. You cannot really do anything against him. Which is okay. You can gun against the bigger... Uh, the one that has only two dice. That's perfect. You also frontal. Frontal goes here. You can throw the emotions now. And draw the sword. Restore your light. Oh yeah, you have a trigram. I forgot. You do have Burning Flash, but also you have Cologne. I cannot use both at the same time. So this will immediately discard this. Yeah, we might have to wait for Cologne for later. And unlock two over here. Some of these are rather awkward, not gonna lie. Let's go with it. Okay. Right now this is looking pretty decent. Except Shao didn't get an emotion level up. Okay, he has one more strength now. Bishi is great. I might want to keep fiery balls. No, I don't. Uh... Oh, that's not good. Actually, you have Will of Prescript. That's fine. Put it here. You should be able to gun again. Very valuable over here. Frontal Assault needs to go somewhere because then we can burn more. Bishi can go here. So you have more strength for next scene. Uh... I want to use this one last. This turn we should be able to use Burning Flash. Uh, we should be able to clone Burning Flash. Put that here and unlock three over here. Make sure that this still goes. No. That this still goes. Where it should... Where's this going? Okay. This should go there. Now you don't have anything to change w this with. So I suppose it's Fiery Waltz time after all. Now you have Fly Flying Dragon for this, by the way. So... You clone twice. That was insane.
Exactly how I wanted that. Nice. We do get the stagger here. Which is actually fine by me. This turn we get the heavy memories. Okay, we have two people with equal health right now, which is nice. But we have someone with very, very little... Uh... Okay, this is going to be difficult now. You burn your way here. You focus fire. Focus fire. Hello? Thanks. Here. And frontal assault literally anywhere else. You have so many counter die, it's not even funny. You have zero cost, you have to use it. Malkuf is in a very bad spot considering her emotion level. I think 4th match flame is really good here. You can use Molto Slash here. Gale Kick goes here. Thank you very much for giving me that. Uh, you definitely want to light. And unlock free. You take a gun. Actually, you can take Bayo Combat here and then take the gun. And you're out of light. In that case, get more. Yeah, 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 I've done multiple mistakes in this fight. The first one is taking this. And you know what they say, it cannot always go according to plan. And not always in my case means never. She's still emotion level 2. We can give this up, guys. We can actually surrender this. Ah. Uh, imagine drawing cards. Oh, now we get multi slash. Imagine actually running a draw engine but never drawing a draw engine.
Yeah, I don't see a way for myself to actually beat this. Uh, this is annoying. This is absolutely annoying. And he doesn't redraw his gun either, and we still don't have a draw. Yikes. He has free strength, what am I gonna do? Okay, 10, 12, 10, 10, not, oh! Ladies and gentlemen, we saw a number below 10. We really are not getting the one page we need, eh? Also, this mass summation cannot really hit. It's a gun. Do we have Ginny? We do have Ginny. First good message today, we do have Ginny. What else can you do? I mean, you can will of a city. Which is better than nothing, I suppose. Alright. The funny part is if we actually hit once before, we could have had like a lot more damage done to him, but now we just die because he has 420 health. It's a mass individual. And Malkut is still emo level 3. That will not matter at all. Oh, oh, I hate this fight. I mean, I don't hate it per se, but it's very annoying. It's massive individual, so it doesn't even matter if we be on here.
Actually, the bigger it is the second one, so it does matter. Let's try to wing beat this. Nice. Finally, emo four. Actually, that could change things. He's overheated right now, is he not? Let's consider we draw good cards next turn. Actually. Do you use your... You don't use your range attack this turn. With just a stroke of luck. He has free. He has plus three strength, so this will probably fail. But it will fail even harder if we don't even try. Let's go. Twenty-three. Yes. No, Eska still died from burn. And you only drew this. And you didn't draw your strongest card in the deck. Great, that's like 10 damage this turn. I could have drawn so many damage cards, but what if I just don't? Why are you still staggered? Why are you still staggered? We're dead. We had two turns, but we couldn't do anything with them. Because, well, imagine drawing damage cards, because I can't. I cannot imagine drawing damage cards, apparently. Two turns, and I cannot draw enough damage. I hate this. How is this singular reception so goddamn annoying? Ah, oh, I'm already feeling 20 episodes of Just Philip. This is already off to an amazing start.
Oh yeah, that's a great opening hand. Oh yeah, that's also great opening hand. Oh golly. Imagine actually getting to play. I literally have nothing right now. It's not even funny. If this is my best first turn, why even bother? We can clone now. I'll see roll three fives on the speed die, and we have. Well, we can technically do something here. If technically, I mean, it's all a farce, but whatever. Uh, you guys have also given me the idea to use a completely cheese strategy and honestly if I somehow can avoid it I want to avoid it but at this point I don't see a way to avoid it anymore at this point apparently it's cheese or die because I just cannot get through his final phase apparently not even with two free turns Oh, hey, we drew Burning Flash. That's a start. Yeah, that's gonna hit. What am I gonna do about it? Please, Markuf, get one in motion coin. You got... Okay, you got the emotion coin, whatever. Now it's the... Oh, we don't get happy memories this time. Well, that's the second downside of opening shit, I suppose.
I think this is already due for a He's gonna focus Lowell. Not only he's gonna focus Lowell, apparently then the entire circus is gonna focus Lowell. But this might work into my favor. So yeah, you will be unable to actually function this this time. I want to use an ammunition. Okay, that was that was sick. That was sick. Not gonna lie, that was sick. Still everything on him, of course. He has the lowest life, and we'll work the second worst deck right now because this will never function. Yeah. I don't see me. I st I don't see myself winning this. We do get forgotten this time, but the main damage to myself has already been done. Greenstein costs five. That's a uh, that's that's sad. Unfortunately, you ha don't have any attack with. Less than perfect dice, so at this point it's just survive. Oh no, you die this turn anyway. Yeah, in that case, just throw it all out. In that case, we also don't want to um, don't want to redirect anything. We need to go all out on the small guys.
Oh yeah, that one will die anyway. Based. I think in this turn I want to use Yazi. Or do I go for Ta I could have go for Tauti on this and just use Multi Slash to restore my light. We're gonna slower. I don't know what triggers first. We could always do this. Those two will definitely die. Gun. As long as you do have a flaming during this, why not use it? Well, that's this. Uh, you don't have a low cost right now. I'll use a second one of these. And one of the unlocks. It's all possible we want to go for as little uh, life on him possible for the next phase. But I swear to god, if this is the one which, which I win, with that shitty of a start, I am going to be sad. I swear to god. Forgotten. Hard to not get hit by that. Okay. We are not yet out of the game. Apparently we are not yet out of the game. I'm still hanging on to dear life. Somehow. You don't need to survive that. Let's go. Very good. This might actually be the run. I hate to admit it, but this might actually be the run. Man's actually overheated right now. 
means this is really good. You just have to hit this. Uh, okay. If this actually is the run, I'm going to cry out of happiness. That's maybe not that great of an idea. I have to stagger him, but at the same time I have to preserve my strength. Apparently that was not how it worked, but it didn't met. Oh my god, this is the run. I cannot believe it. By all means, I cannot believe it. This is the run that felt the worst from the start. This is literally the run that felt the worst from the start. Out of all four runs we did, this felt the worst in the beginning. How on earth did we turn this around? What? I am actually dumbfounded right now. But at the same time, I'm incredibly happy. <laughs> Philip is dead. Philip is actually dead. The rewards for the reception of a reverberation ensemble can only be redeemed once. Philip's page and rekindle strike. Now we cannot change anything here. But just just for reference, but let's do it on on here, just for reference. What the hell? That's a lot of damage. That is a lot of damage. How does this look? Ooh, that looks sick. Don't rekindle strike. Yo. Oh, they made it so Blazing Strike also works on this page. That's fi that's sick. That's sick. I uh, still cannot believe what just happened. Not gonna lie. But we finished the first Reverb Ensemble guy.
in Philip. Next up, we have to we are going to Yesod's floor and are facing what I believe to be the Church of Gears. I I still cannot believe it, but yeah. I hope you guys have a wonderful time. And see you guys in the next episode of Library of Ruina. Bye-bye.